Hello everybody, this is Zurich 1983 and welcome back. Alright, so let's uh, start making our way towards the blue star. Gotta get those dragon's eyes now. And the first one is probably in a place where you'd never look for it. <laughs> Remember that uh, beginning scene of the game pretty much where we met Hero and uh, Ruby? Yeah, we gotta go back into those uh, ruins, so we're going home. Across. I can't even remember what the name of that town was. <laughs> there we go. Alright, there are new enemies, I guess you could say. We'll be fighting, so I'll demonstrate them as they come up. Here's the first two new enemies, Elemental, Fire Elemental, and Kenneth I guess Fire Elemental, you might recognize them, you know. <laughs> but this is your first chance to see what that Lucius tier does. Haha, <laughs> sucker. But yeah, the Fire Ele Elementals have about 450 HP, and the Kenneth Thug has around 800, so. There's another new enemy, Blood Lords. Uh, they've got about uh, 900 HP or so. Is it just me or is Krista the uh, one of Ultimecia's uh, servants, or whatever? In Final Fantasy, VIII look a lot like those, that, the model for that Blood Lord. Man, how much did they rip off of this game? <laughs> That never occurred to me. Right. This chest contains the dragon armor. I'll give that to Hero. And drop the other one in the uh, Ruby. There we go. There is one more new enemy in here. But we get the dragon shield first. <laughs> Alright, let's give it to Hero and then give the storm shield to Leo.
And here. Hey, there we go. Take it. No idea. And a life bracelet for Ron Far, but what he has in right now is better. Alright, well, the uh, one enemy I couldn't fight was the Decepticon. It looks like a, I don't know, kind of weird looking. <laughs> it doesn't look like a Transformer, I'll put it that way. But it's got about 900 HP, so... Uh, Alright, I want to take care of a couple of uh, equipment things, and I'll be right back. Alright, I had to put the life bracelet on Ronfar for a little extra defense. Jean, I gave her the Goddess Crest, and Leo now has uh, the Wind Pendant, because that's going to come in very handy coming up, so let's go. Okay, this is the serious doppelganger fight. Everybody has one. Um, obviously here, they've all got about five times the amount of uh, HP as you have, so yeah, this is pretty much a boss fight, so just have everybody go all out on every on a hero for now. Um, she'll use crematorium, and uh, actually no, I'll have her use uh, magic shield. And Leo, oops, no, I'm gonna have Leo attack as well. Kill doppelganger hero. <laughs> so yeah, doppelganger hero probably has closer to 5,000 HP. Ow. Sweet. Yeah, don't worry about doppelganger Leo. I've heard that maybe in, in other versions he might be a bit annoying, but uh, in this one he doesn't do much damage, so... I was hoping Lamina would be able to get her magic shield off before everybody got scattered, but... Ronfar might be able to get a piece of it. Hey, maybe. Good. The people I want to have it. Oh, come on! <laughs> Alright. Where is he? There we go. Uh, let's have him with the uh, yeah, shiny one, yeah, I guess. Jean, the blue dragon trap, her with the crematorium, and him attack hero as well. Sweet! Alright. Our survival rate just skyrocketed. <laughs> Ow. I thought that Leo wasn't supposed to hurt. <laughs> Ow! Jeez. Knock it off. <laughs> Done yet? <laughs> Holy jeez. We survived! That's a lot of stuff. Sweet. Alrighty, and the last chest contains a shaman staff for Lamina. Alright, I guess that's all the time I have for this video. In the next video, we'll uh, go to the next area that has a uh, dragon eye, and we'll uh, continue on our quest to get Hero to the Blue Star. This is Sirik1983 signing off. See you next time.